I had filmed the video weeks before, by the way, just to let you know. Um, I had the video done, but I just was like unsure about it. <laughs> For me, it was a it was a it was a therapy thing. Mm. So so. I wanted to do it on camera and 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 see if that was enough for me. Mm. It was kind of like a little experiment. Like if I if I say this on camera, how will I feel? Would I feel released? Mm. And um, I kept it, and then um, I had the intention to post it once inspired. You, two things. First, when you recorded it and you had said what you wanted to say and you knew that you had said it, and two, when you put it out into the into the world, like how did you how how did you feel finally? You know, it felt um, it felt really freeing on another on another level because um, as much as on my in my day to day I'm very open about it it's still an issue for me mm-hmm. I, I I mentioned in the video there was um, someone from my past there yeah, was someone yeah. there was someone um, from my past that I grew up with this um, this man um, who I knew he asked me if I was Muslim. And um, I told him that I was just just beca- just out of fear, mm. and um, I felt really ashamed of myself and my and my lack of conviction, mm. and, the, and and also just realizing how deeply it still affects me. Um, because if I if I had mentioned to him that I was not I was not a Muslim, he would have probably spread this word around, and it would have gotten back to my family. And again, the the fear of um, not disappointing or you know bringing shame onto my family. Um. Secular Jihadists is an increasingly influential podcast with much of its growing audience in Muslim-majority countries advocating for atheists, secularists, and Enlightenment thinkers. We want to reach out to more people. If we reach 500 patrons, we will be able to translate our shows into Arabic, Urdu, Persian, Bengali, Malay, Turkish, and other languages in these countries. Help us get there at patreon.com slash S-J-M-E.